All right, we all know by the title what's happened, but um, essentially, someone in my Discord did a 40 pull and they pulled two S class uh, Dwight's. So, yeah, then Masks added me on the Discord and I was like, don't fucking tempt me. And I shit you not. Six minutes later, uh, I put a message in Discord saying, 100 pull up tonight. So, yeah, it, it really did not take much to, uh, to tempt me, if you will. So, essentially, what happened was, um, yeah, I, I get tempted. People, I was like, all right, I'll do a temple. The cards are dropping pretty good. So, the temple then went on to a 40 pool. And then, yeah, you can tell by the title, it just went to a 100. In other words, I used all my coins. So, here's the logic, right? I... I knew um, if if I still had coins, I would be tempted. And if I don't have coins, I can't be tempted to do balls because I simply don't have fucking coins. I would never drop under a thousand coins for war purposes. And it, I know, if I left coins um, out, I'd probably spend on something stupid, like some crap in the uh, offer shop or something. Like 200 coins here, 300 coins there. And it's just, it's just not good. So I was like, all right. I know it's five times chances. There's still a few things in here I would like. An S-Class Job. Another S-Class Mr. Lou because that would be funny as fuck. Um, also, a Marge would be sweet. Um, you know, anything I really haven't got would be good. So, yeah, those three are what I'd be aiming for. And obviously, a Dwight would be really sweet as well. So, yeah, I thought I'd go all in on this. Just because then I don't have any coins to tempt myself with further pulls. Because um, I'm not going to buy any more coins, you know. It'll be tap joy from here on out. So yeah, as you did see there, we have a uh, we have a six star Marcus. But if you see my prior video, you'd know that's fucking useless to me since I pulled the S class. So yeah, we pulled a uh, five star Mister Lou and a six star Marcus so far. Not great, not bad. You know, for me, it's it's fucking horrible because I've already claimed two S class Mister Lou, so I can't physically claim a third. Um. So, yeah, that's very annoying. Uh, and obviously, in Marcus, I could probably get another S-Class Marcus. But, um, you know, I don't see the value in doing that since one will be more than enough. So, yeah. Now, we just wait for the rest of the pools and comment right now. Do you think I'm getting anything good? Do you think I'm going to get anything bad? Or do you think uh, I might get something mediocre? What do you think? So, as you can see, that's the 40 done. It was a decent 40. We got Marcus and Mr. Lou. And then we got... 40 and a 10 to go so fun little fact when i had um when i finished this 40 pool i was contemplating doing another 10 because i was like all right i need to save myself some coins but then i was like i i would use the 10 regardless the the 2200 coins so i was like all right fuck it we're just going to use all the coins so as you can see we're still getting a decent amount of dwight cards i must say like the odds for cards this time around is really really good so as you can see, like, cards are popping up really, like, really good. Like, at a decent pace. Obviously, I would have been a bit more happier if I had um, less fucking five stars. Because, honestly, the five stars are just clogging up my inventory. And I got to keep selling them. And I got to figure out, do I have a duplicate of this? Do I have one of it? And then, you know, it's just a long process. I wish I would just, like, at the end of your pool, give you the option to click on the characters. And then you can sell them straight to the depot. Like, that would be a really cool idea, like... At the end of your 40 pool temple, you can click on the character and then you can just sell it from that um sell it from that option or that menu. That's a really good idea. Scopely, take notes on that. Really good idea. Um, but regardless, it is like a, a few thousand um depot points, which depot points have definitely went up in value. So I will say uh fair enough to them. As you can see, we still get more Romanovs, like Romanovs just shitting out. Same with Ivanova. Uh spoiler alert, by the end of the video, I think I had uh, three Romanovs, uh, what else did we have an absolute abundance of? I think I have quite a few of those Samurai Jesuses, a few Ks, like, I'm telling you, I had a lot of Lester as well. Uh, I think I had, like, three Abraham. Oh, wrong Dwight. What a fucking shocker, am I right? So, yeah, this pool is gone to shit. I think you can just tell by my voice that I, I somewhat regret my decisions, but... You know, it is what it is. I do have diamond tokens, so... Yay! <laughs> so, Red Glenn, he was great a while ago. I've got, like, four of him now. Uh, and then we get some more cards, you know. 
these codes are fucking useless to me. You know, yeah, I think we all know where this is going. It's just dog shit. Just dog shit, but it is what it is. Until we pull an S-Class march. There we go, boys. My luck is still on point. And, um, yeah, I was actually looking forward to an S-Class march because uh, there is definitely a few things I want to I wanna do with, that, with uh, that one. So, yeah. Uh, I will have a few tower teams with that, I reckon. I reckon that'll be very fun to play with, having a tower team with that. But here's the decision, right? I've got 2,500 Dwight cards. I have enough diamond tokens to grab two more five, well, of the five star and the six star. Do I do it? Leave it in the comments. Do I pick up the two? Because if so, I'd be only ooh, like 3,500 cards off, I think. So, yeah. Leave it in the comments. Should I buy the Dwights or not? And uh, yeah, tell me if you think, if you're lucky. Discord links in the description. Masks channel link is in the description. And uh, hope you all have a good day. Peace.